everyone. It's Jamie Zebra 23. I'm doing your tarot cards of the day for March 25th, 2018. I'm using the Crystal Tarot deck by Philip Permute. I got these cards off of Amazon. They were super cheap. Um, okay, so you got three cards for today. You've got the Page of Cups in the reverse. You've got the, um, the uh, Aurora card and you've got the Jesus I Trust in You card. So let's start with the Page of Cups in the reverse. So for some of you, you could be getting some bad news from a Cancer, a Pisces, or a Scorpio, or somebody holding this energy. Or uh, Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, you could be getting a phone call like that. Or somebody with that energy. Um, this person is in the reverse. So for some of you, you are expecting a phone call from someone, but then you might not get it. So somebody might tell you, oh, I'm going to call you at 8 o'clock tomorrow. Or I'm going to call you at 8 o'clock tonight. Or... Or they just have not called you. There's been no correspondence. You could chalk it up to Mercury Retrograde Energy. Or this just could be a simple situation of somebody just not wanting to call you. Um, sometimes it's that simple. Somebody gets tired, caught up. Um, we all get, we all, we all exhibit that energy sometime or have those feelings at some time or another. Where maybe things were going good, but then all of a sudden, abruptly, for no reason, you're just like, you know what? I'm just not feeling it anymore. So somebody could be having that energy. Also, I feel like for some of you, um, somebody may have contacted you. Um, a Cancer Pisces or a Scorpio, or um, you could have contacted a Cancer Pisces or a Scorpio who, who may have forgotten about you. But then by you contacting them, you kind of stirred up some feelings. Some old romantic feelings or feelings of missing someone, longing someone. Maybe you were almost over it, but then they, they uh, opened that can of worms again. So now you're back at square one. You know, so it's kind of like it would have been better if the person never would have contacted because then you would have been over it. Mm. Now let's move to the Aurora card. This card is from the Doreen Virtue Messages from Your Angels by Doreen Virtue. I also got those on Amazon. Look at the pretty cards. Oh, I love these. Okay, oh, I want to, I want you guys to have a closer look at this card. pretty okay so from the aurora card you're flying high right now which may threaten others but don't descend because others will soon become inspired by your example so yeah so all the people that are naysaying you telling you that you're no good you're this or that you know trying to throw dirt on your name um let them do it but don't you stop what you're doing you know it takes all kinds of kinds i think that's a miranda lambert song I think, or it might be somebody else. I think it might be somebody else's, but anyway. So it's basically like it takes all kinds of kinds to make this world go round. We can't all be clones. We're all welcome in society and we're all welcome in this world. There's, you know, there's gotta be a bank and there's gotta be a bank robber. It's just how it goes. You know, there's light and dark, good with the bad. It's, it all goes together. So whatever you happen to be doing, you're meant to be doing it. Whatever your neighbor's doing, they're meant to be doing it. You and your neighbor don't have to do the same things. So don't let other people cut you down. Maybe your ideas are different than from the typical or the norm. Maybe maybe you're 50 years old and you just got a divorce and um, you're empty nesting and you don't know where to go from here. Guess what? That's your journey. That's your path. Nobody should be saying, oh, I feel so sorry for you. Oh, yeah. That's none of their business. So it takes all kinds of kinds. So you just keep doing what you're doing. Keep uh, marching to the beat of your own drum and just keep on keeping on because this is your life. You... Nobody else can tell you what to do with it. So now let's do the Jesus cards. Okay, I love these cards. Okay, they're they're actually not Jesus cards. They're called. I, oh, and guess what? Okay, guess, guess what's peeking out? So I thought I got all the cards out. There's still one. This one, the 23rd Psalm. So I'll read this one too. Okay, so anyway, so these are called Saint Prayer cards. I got these on Amazon too. I love these. So I, I didn't really know what to expect from these cards, but I, I'm in love with them. I go through these every day. So let me read to you the this first one and then I'll read this other one. Jesus, I trust in you. The Chaplet of the Divine Mercy. Okay. Prayer one. Wait, it says pray one. Our Father, Hail Mary, the Apostles' Creed, then on the Our Father beads pray, pray. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and the blood, the soul and the divinity of your dearly beloved son, our Lord Jesus Christ, an atonement for our sins and those of the world on the Hail Mary beads pray for the sake of his sorrow, sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. In conclusion, pray three times. Holy God, holy mighty one, holy immortal, one have mercy on us and on the whole world. 
So I'm going to um, take a picture of this and post it on Facebook. For those of you that do have the prayer beads, I don't. Um, so I just, I just recite these things. Um, and I think that's enough. But for those of you that, uh, that feel like you need to use the beads, go for it. And then I'm going to do the 23rd Psalm. It's so crazy. Okay, that this was here. So somebody needs to hear this. I'm going to post this one as well. I think the last time this came up, I was supposed to post it and I got sidetracked. So in between, so in between the readings that I do for you guys, I have personal readings. So like I'll be recording this one and like in 10 minutes, I've got a reading to do. And then what happens is, um, sorry, sorry about that. That's my, my aunt. She's a little loud. Um, <laughs> like me. It runs in the family. Okay, so um, so yeah, so I have like an hour long reading in about 10 minutes. So I have to upload this video. I won't be able to upload this video because I've got a reading. So whenever I, I'm able to upload, that's when I do it. So that's why I try to, to upload as many as I can or record as many as I can so that I can upload here and there whenever I can because it takes a long time to upload. Okay, and then in between the answering the $8 one question one answers, filling the orders for all the, the different candles and whatnot, so I'm doing my best, guys. Okay, so the 23rd Psalm. Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside the still waters. He restores my soul. He leads me in the path of righteousness. For his name's sake, ye, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For you are with me, your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my forehead with oil. My cup overflows. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. And I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Through Jesus' name, amen. So, yes, yeah, so these are beautiful cards. Okay, guys, so that was your tarot card of the day for March 25th, 2018. If you'd like a personal reading, you can check out the website, jamiezebra23.com. My readings are 20 minutes, 40 minutes, and 60 minutes. I typically do your readings within 24 to 72 hours. I also have a new feature, same-day readings. It's a little pricier, but you do get your readings the same day. I have an $8 one question, one answer via email only. Um, I don't have PayPal. I don't do pre-recorded readings. I don't do email readings. I don't do Facebook readings. I don't do WhatsApp readings. I do readings over the phone, through Skype, or through FaceTime. Um, I also have new items on the website, incense, incense holders, candles, lost day away candles, um, blessing candles, open roads candles, tons of stuff for you guys. All right, ta-ta for now.